Right, this is a little video uh, to show Odemix um, running on Amiga um, AGA. Uh, this is my latest Doom port. Um, I've done <coughs> Boom, I've done Z Doom, and now I've done Odemix. Um, yeah, so this is um, this is 064. Um, so it's not the latest version of Odemix, but it's the latest version I can get to to run on this this old hardware. Um, Duke Nukem, this, this particular port's quite slow. Um, there's other ports on here um, that I can show you that run a bit quicker. Uh, it's still usable on this, this 060, which is not great. Z Doom runs this a bit better. Yeah, this is the most advanced um, Doom port you can get now for um, Amiga AGA. So I'll load up the, you can actually load up um, new watch files on the fly, which is pretty cool. Um, it's not it's not recommended though. Um, it's better just to specify it in the um, in your tool types. I think this I think this causes uh, memory corruption when you load them up like this. It's quite slow um, loading up different mod files. This game uh, really hammers the hard drive. So hopefully this will load up in a sec. There you go. This this particular WAD file runs a bit better. Okay. Now we've got another way of playing uh, Wolfenstein on um, Amiga AGA. It's quite funny really. Um, and you can also obviously load up um, Doom itself. So yeah, this is um, this is a good little port. It's taken quite a while actually. It took a, a long time to get to run fast or reasonably fast. It didn't take long to get running initially. But to actually get it running properly with um, the SEL on um, AGA, that took a long time. So there you go. Odemix. AGA.